They said it couldn't be done. Well, Scott's gonna get they two said it wouldn't last. White man, black man. America F1. America F1 coming to you straight from San Francisco, California. Sherman Tillman, Michael Lawler. America F1. Look at that cute. What is that? Is, yeah. that, is that a GoPro? No, it's not. Oh. We rolling? We are rolling. We'd like to uh, call this the final show of 2024. Uh, we'd like to crown <laughs> Red Bull and Max for stupid as the oh, world champions. Man, Max, I wish they'd just go give him the trophy just now. Give him the I mean, trophy now. And even just Perez comes in him. second. And it's like, and no one had nothing, nothing. Well, welcome to another adventure. The Ferraris look. <laughs> With the Ferraris had brake issues the whole time. Something was wrong with the Mercedes the whole time. The McLarens aren't what we thought the McLarens were going to be. And then Fernando, I think he got 10th. No, we got 9th. We got 9th? Okay. But don't get ahead of yourself. You know? I mean, you're trying to get ahead of yourself. Let me do the... Look, first, you got your mic upside down. Okay. Like, oh. fix your mic. Yes, sir. We got two mics. Everybody knows why you have two mics. One's for the camera. One's for the podcast. Um, so first, welcome to the first episode of the new season of America F1 for Formula One Racing. Yeah. Boring. First race of the year was the Bahrain. 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 Ba Bahrain. Bahrain Grand Prix. <laughs> Bahrain. And Bahrain. We're just kidding. Man, oh man. Ass whooping. Uh, first, we'd like you to subscribe to our channel, subscribe to our podcast. We'd like you to comment, we'd send like us money. Like, uh, yeah, we have buy us a coffee. If you buy one cup of coffee for us a month, then it can help with the reconstruction of our podcast room, which we're doing right now. Sherman's Sherman's investing. I'm um, investing maybe money. A hundred dollars into the whole thing. <laughs> At least a hundred dollars. <laughs> so we 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 would. And then he's gonna tell me I gotta pay my cut, and then never he tell has me to how pay much. His cut, and never and how I much. I haven't, I I haven't told it up, and I don't know why I keep doing this <laughs> for but, three, two years uh, now. It's almost three. This is our third season, so Sherman's not good at the math. He's not good at pronunciation. I am he good at the math. He doesn't retain. I, I am shit good very at the well. math. He doesn't know what he's talking. About. <laughs> he's starting to lose it. I am good at the math, and not only am I good at the math. Wait, you don't know how to add? You haven't added up if you, all this money you say I owe you. Yeah, I haven't. Um, I'll get around to it. I guess I'll get around to it when I start doing the taxes. When I get the taxes done, then that's when I'll get around to it. You said that the last two years. You never... I, I'm going to get around to it, I swear. All right, let's get down to the show. First of all, you... How far was Max for stepping ahead today? By a half a lap. He was so far ahead. He lapped all the way up to like NASA, ninth or eighth or something. Like he was so far ahead that NASA actually had to turn the Hubble telescope around to Earth to find out where he was on track. That's a good point. Max was so far ahead of Checo today that he was playing video games on one lap. I saw him look down and I saw Call of Duty playing in the background. I saw him. He took a he took a espresso break at one point. Um, he he wasn't driving at, with any sort of urgency. Uh, he had the engine turned down. Um, so did so did Checo. He wasn't. He Max was so far ahead. He baked a cake. Took his girlfriend out to dinner, then came back to the track, got in the car, had, no, he had a nap. and he still had a 10-second lead. He had lead. a nap, and he was still half a lap oh, ahead. Oh, man. You realize he would have, if he wanted to, he could have lapped the entire field today. That's how far ahead the Red Bull is. There is no racing until 2026, so just, it's just going to be this crap for the next two seasons. Because nobody's going to develop their car. Why would you? Now everyone's going to take all their money and, develop, and, and put it into the 2026 car. Okay. Listen, the ratings are down ten percent last year. They're going to be down ten percent this year. They're no going to go down again this year. Not only that, what they should do is speed up the process. Instead of twenty twenty six, they should make it twenty twenty five, and that would that would that would really throw a, a monkey wrench into well, everything. 
the Netflix, your favorite show, Drive to Survive, which you love and you I always watched, watch. I haven't watched any episodes ever. I've the watched ratings one. are down twenty two percent. Just for Drive to Survive. Just for Drive to Survive. Well, that's in America, right? That's everywhere. Oh, Netflix, everywhere. It's down twenty two percent. Okay, so that show's gonna get canceled. So and Liberty, they have a NASCAR one coming out. I, I watched that. Is they have good? one. Yeah, it's all right. It's all right. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's, it's a NASCAR. It's, worth watching. it's, it's a, a NASCAR. It's a worth watching. <laughs> but here's the thing. Remember when they had Mercedes dominance? They always would find something wrong with the Mercedes that they would try to bring the Mercedes back to the field. Even now, though they just kick the shit out of everyone. For now, years. are they going to do the same thing with Red Bull? They hate Red Bull. Everyone hates Red Bull. That's the problem. They hate the culture. They hate Christian Horner, especially with his these new allegations, which I don't believe are true now because somebody just unloaded all these fake emails and stuff, on, but they didn't say who they were. Right. So that's... Well, you, you you're can't, not going to say who you are. No, but if you if it was a, if it was for real, yes, you would. Well, here here's the thing on that, and which is interesting, is well, he was he was Christian exonerated. Warner, he was exonerated of whatever he did. Yeah, but why did they? I mean, they investigated themselves. They had a guy. They picked no, they a, hired. A, they, they hired somebody to. Outside. It's an internal investigation, basically. Yeah, but they they were it's it's a cover your ass investigation. Of course. So. But they, they covered their ass. They realized it wasn't a big deal, and they moved on. The end. I really don't want to get into this whole thing because I think, you know, I always believe I in innocent. I think it was a smear campaign. I, I, I that's always I believe in innocent until proven guilty. That's the first thing. I, I, and I don't think he did. And, and what, 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 what did he supposedly do with this person? There's like uh, multiple. Text, text or something. That's it? It's like, and come on now. Picks, like, whatever. But here's the thing. She texted him back, He though. left his original wife. For Terry? the Spice Girl, the Spice Girl, uh, yeah, Ginger that's Spice? his second wife. Are you sure? Yes. Oh yeah, I read about. Oh, this. I thought he, I thought that was no. his only. So one. he had left his original wife for her. Does he have any kids with his original? I, wife? I don't know. I didn't uh, get that deep into the weeds. But, I know he's got two but kids. Helmut with Marco Jerry. has like xenophobia. Her name is Jerry, by the way. Right, Helmut Marco, la- xenophobia. You know, remember you kept calling Checo kind of out of his name. All right. Then Somebody you, called him a then, Mexican, even then, though he's a Mexican. No, he didn't call him a Mexican. I think he called him a, a Venezuelan or so. He oh, called him something else. <laughs> I remember? forgot about that. that remember funny. he called him something else. He called, he called him a, a different country in yeah. Latin America. In Latin America. <laughs> okay. And then, uh, but that's racist somehow. I have no idea. Well, xenophobia. What? I, whatever. I guess what whatever that is. But, I, who but knows? then you also have <laughs> Max's girlfriend's dad who said the things about Hamilton. Well, what he said wasn't right. It turned out to be not, not a big deal. I, I read about that. No, 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 no. Because you, when you talk to Portuguese people, people from Brazil, well, they said it, the way they he said, said it. that that word is like the N word to us. That's what they said. That's what they no, said. That turned, that's what they not, said. that turned out not to be but true. That, no, it was true. That's no, what they the said. Way, the way he said it. No, though, there's it no was... way. He, you can't say the N word in a way that's fun. But he didn't you say can't the say N word. Like, kind of, it's loving. The translation was actually a little no, black. No, it was A little brown boy is what it was. No, the dude's racist. That's the actual definition. No, no, That's why. Well, why'd they ban him from the. From the pattern, and they still they, okay. They banned so it them. must have been bad. They didn't like. If it wasn't they, that bad. Well, they, they wouldn't have been. They didn't like the that because it's a corporation, and they don't want to ever be thought of as racist. So they're gonna. They don't want to lose the black two black people who watch Formula One now. The, well, there's more than two black people. <laughs> Everybody watches because there's Lewis. But let, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's not lose that. Then they cheat, right? With the who cost cheated? cap. The cost cap. They all cheat. But they got caught. They got caught. Okay, so we got cheating. We got yeah, cost got, cap. We got and they got taken away uh, a bunch of uh, wind tunnel and testing Ooh, and all and money. Was it like ten percent? Ooh, and it made and a big and difference. And, and then they they show up with a Mercedes car. <laughs> that was so funny when I saw that. I was like, yeah, they're beating Mercedes with their own car. It's awesome. Well, I, I, I was like, I, awesome. I, I saw it and I'm like, I'm like, <laughs> it's great. I'm like, I'm looking at it at first and I'm like, something's wrong. What the is this real? And then I went and looked up the last year's Mercedes before they put the side pods on it. And I'm like, holy shit, they took Mercedes design. They must have been so far ahead last year to just... Because they didn't develop that car at all last year. They only brought like one uh, thingamajigger or two thingamajiggers to, to the car. You and the thing. They never brought You're upgrades to that car last year. I was just thinking about that. They only brought like one or two. They changed the side pods a little yeah. bit last year, and that was about it. So... They spent all their money on this what, new car, and they stole Mercedes' idea, but, and then they made it work. <laughs> Red Bull is like the evil empire. Oh, well, they're they're like the no, Death Star. No, Mercedes you know, is the evil no, empire. No, they're not because at least 
corporate wise, well, they look okay. Mercedes are fucked right Red now. Red Bull I'm just has gonna... all kinds of issues behind the scenes mm. in how they behave. But, but they've not always only, had those. But wait, but not issues. only that. They've always Ford been the party boy company. is saying that they're probably going to pull out. That they're then, not. Then they, then they go back to Honda, which is what they want. Well, anyways. they're going to have to cry to go back to Honda. Mm-mm. They're going to cry to go back to Honda because Ford doesn't want to be involved. Honda doesn't want to be in the back of an Aston Martin because then they're going to have to change the name to the Honda team. That's what that's what happened to Austin Martin. I'm predicting that Red Bull goes back to Honda. I'm predicting that Hon- that Ford, Ford go, goes is going to pull out and go to somebody else and go to Aston Martin. Yeah. Maybe. Because they just don't want... It's two years. It's an American company. They just don't want to deal with it. They well, don't want to okay. deal with all the baggage. Ford wasn't going to do anything but give Red Bull money. That's all they were going to do. They have they have no technical alliance with Red Bull. Red Bull have their own powertrains now. They make right. their own engines now. So. so, let's get back into Max. Super Max. Super Max! Verstappen. Verstappen. Shut up. Shut His up name with that. is Verstappen. Just stop not it Verstappen. all the time doing that. God. You're not my You're mother. I'm an old graduate. man. You, you can't, can't even stop, pronunciate stop a man's it. name properly. Ah. That's like someone calling you Sherman Illman. Uh, okay. Ladies and gentlemen, the Sherman it. Illman show. All right. So, listen to this one, Mike. Okay. So, Max Verstappen won 19 races out of 22 races last year. This year, there's going to be 24 races. My prediction is Max is going to win at least 20 races. He's going to break his own record. The only way he's not going to win is if the car breaks. Do you really want to watch 24 races that look like the Bahrain Grand Prix? They're going to be worse than the okay, the Bahrain Grand the ba, ba, Bahrain, Bahrain, the Bahrain, the Bahrain, the Bahrain, Bahrain, Bahrain. Bahrain. Anyways, if I say it three times really fast. Will I get it right? If if Bahrain, Bahrain, Bahrain. If Red Bull wanted to, they could have lapped the entire field. That's how much. That's how yeah, faster they are they than were. everybody else. It's like really bad. They're, and all the all the teams are like, we made steps this year, and they're all like, you could see the look in their eyes, like, yeah, but Red Bull made a bigger one. So last year, even even if Red Bull had last year's car, they still would have won today. Because I think most of that car is last year's underneath. It's probably well, underneath, yeah. definitely, definitely. I think Red Bull did this just to smack. Mercedes, Mercedes yeah, just, just like, look like what we can do. Look what we can do. We can do what you did, but do it better. F F F F. Finger, 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 finger. All finger, I gotta finger, say finger, is, finger, I think, finger, I think finger, Mercedes finger. is done as a team now. Yeah. I don't think they're gonna be uh, a yeah. top tier team anymore. I think Mercedes. Well, we'll is get gonna, to that. I, I really believe that. I really believe that, especially when Hamilton they don't leaves, look they're gonna at, go. They don't look. They're they definitely gonna go down. They're they gonna, did not. We'll talk about that later. That's that's later in the show. They did not have a good race. So last year we did. 10 through 1. We would go to number 10 and we go up to number 1 and tell you about that. But this okay. year we're going to go from number 1 down to number 10. So we've already talked about Super Max for stepping. Now we're going to go to check. Verstappen. You said Verstappen again. His name is Verstappen. It's like. Ver stupid. Okay, there you go. Now we're going to go to Checo. Checo Sergio did good Perez today. Perez did great today. He, he, was came, awesome. he came in second. He, 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 he never qualifies all that good. That's what Red Bull likes about him because he doesn't have to fight with what, Max? with Verstupid for mm-hmm. the uh, mm-hmm. pole, and then he somehow he always comes through the field and ends up second or third, and that's all they need to he win a championship. He had some great, and I do mean great passes. I mean they weren't great, but they're all right. But this is he a, did what he had to do. Well, this is a boring track, there's, and it was nice and clean. There's only but, one place to pass people, and that's on the stri- front straightaway, and that's everyone passes in the same place. You open up no, the DRS. Well, he, he passed them on turn one. Yeah, it's yeah. turn one. That's yeah, but you, you said the straight just now. That's the straight. The, well, there's a straight and there's a turn. For the first, the big straight and the turn one. Well, turn one is different from the straight. Okay, isn't it? the straight before okay. turn one. How, get it together. Uh, all right, here we all right, go. Get it together. But anyways, that's the only place to pass on this track. It's sort of a hoopty track. It's a Herman Tilka track. So he. It's all right. Qualified it's fun fifth. on the video game. It's, he qualified fifth. Yeah. Right, and so now he finished second. And he finished second. And that's great. So they only, need him, great... they, they only need him to finish top five for them to win the championship. That's and, all. And here's another thing about Checo. He and ain't going nowhere. First I was... of all, he, he had a great race. Second of all, why are they talking about replacing Checo? They're not Checo going shouldn't replace. retire. Checo shouldn't go anywhere. They've won with Checo. They're going to keep that. He's if going... Checo has this type of form, they're going, they're going they should sign, sign him they're, again. They're going to sign him to a two-year deal. They should. Right. they should. He's going to be there 25, 26. They should. He works well Unless with Max. They, he knows he's the number two. He's not going to give Max any problems. But he's going to win his couple races a year. 
But if, he, ha- if he has a slump like he did last year. Which I don't think he will. If he does, I'm just saying, Richardo's just sitting there waiting. Yeah, you, know but, he's got, you know he's got some sort of contract. Richardo's not even better than Yuki. He's not even better than Yuki. He already, Yuki no, he, no, he's not made, they, made, they moved him over to... We'll talk about that stuff. <laughs> skipping ahead. I knew right. you were going to love that. So, Who's Checo the- should stay. He should tell Checo, tell your people, you want a new contract. You're going to stay with Red Bull. Red Bull wins with you. There's harmony there. You and Max work well together. You're the number two. Max is the number one. He has nothing to worry about from you. So, you should stay. Checo should stay in Red Bull. Stop talking about Ricardo. Stop talking about all these other people. Don't slump. It has to be. You get Sergio, this, this is Checo, the only, this is, Perez. That that's the only seat in Formula One I consider that is always open for someone to come in halfway through the season. They're yeah. the only team that would do that. They're the only team that yeah. do that. So in third place, Carlos Sainz, who passed and had a good fight with Charles Leclerc twice. But Charles Leclerc complained about was brakes. Brakes, brakes were yeah. brakes were horrible. But I don't care if the brakes were horrible. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. That's they had some really, sort of really, 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 really close racing. And they didn't touch. At, for, for a mm-hmm. second, I thought they were going to hit. And nope. then Science pulled out and then passed up Charles. He had good pace. And I think by the end of the race, he was he was lapping just as well as Checo. 37 days to Thailand. And then... <laughs> <laughs> well, I got you beat because I'm going to Suzuka. When? I'm going next, next month. Oh. Because I'm going uh, to meet my brother for the Cherry Blossom. You should come down there. to Costa Mui and, and hang then out I'm just going to go to... To check out Suzuka, and he, so, still, he lives in Singapore, right? He lives in Indonesia. How far? That's next to Singapore, though. Man, I'm going to Japan. I don't care oh, about you don't Singapore. Give it, you don't care about don't no care about Singapore. Singapore, no. All right, so you Carlos Sainz had a good race. Married? Yeah, he is married. He is you married. got kids? No, no. He's smart. <laughs> no kids. No kids. <laughs> How old is he now? He is nine years younger than me. Oh shoot! So he, I forgot yeah. he was so much younger than us. Yeah. So. He was like a little, little brother. Yeah, little brother. Yeah. He was like almost like your kid, almost, because he was so much younger. Okay. Anyway. Charles Leclerc had a good race also. He had problems with his brakes, I'd say, for the first probably, what, 15 laps or so? Okay. Because well, he kept turning. He kept going wide at turn. Well, well now, like, yeah, that's because his time. brakes don't work. Well, I know. He had problems with his brakes. I know Anyways, he had problems with his brakes. The, the Ferrari is the, definitely the number two car. Definitely. Um. The Mercedes, I just, I feel really bad for the Mercedes team. Well, right we now. haven't got to Mercedes yet. We're still they're talking the, about Charles they're, Leclerc. They're, what? What do you want to talk about, Charles Leclerc? He had, he, he had nice hair today too. Did he? Yeah, his All hair right. looked good. When he took off his helmet, his hair looked nice. All right. Okay. So. <laughs> <laughs> well, all right. His hair looked nice. Great. Great. He had nice hair. We, and... we have nothing to talk about because there was no race today. <sighs> oh. The poor announcers, they were just trying to find something to talk about. Well, because they know for the next two fucking seasons, this is what it's going to be like. They, There's nothing they can do unless they change the rules early, which is what I, I'm begging them. Do it now. Just say the, the all the regs got to change next year. I mean, the only thing I was happy with is that they didn't sh- show a lot of Christian Horner. Actually, they only showed him one time <laughs> at the end of the race. And I think that was by someone, mistake. Someone's doing a smear campaign. I think on that was Christian. by mistake because I'm pretty sure the network was told, hey, don't show this guy. You know, oh, I'm yeah, pretty sure. I think it's a smear campaign against Christian Horner. What he he texted one of the girls in who fifth place, with him. who I thought had a disappointing race when you think about it, Ooh. because. George Russell was second. For well, a lot his of the car race. broke too. The the Mercedes had it didn't all kinds break. Of he had that overheating issue, supposedly. Yeah, that's called the car didn't wasn't able to perform. It broke, and sure and um. But that didn't happen until later on in the race. Hamilton said his seat broke. I have no idea what. Ha- yeah, that, that was strange. Yeah, and and I, really I guess it, we, it must have cracked. But in we can the... talk about Hamilton when we get to Hamilton. Oh, we still... should be talking about George Russell right now. Okay. Okay. What's, what's about George? But why do you always skip ahead? Because there's no, nothing to talk about. That? He didn't do anything. He just, he... Let's talk about George Russell. Did he come in fourth? You know, I don't like George Russell that much. You know that. <laughs> I, I forgot. You, you don't like one point. I, I don't like one point that much, okay? But I'm giving you an opportunity to talk about George Russell. What's to talk about? I cut he, you off. He was I don't in like second place. He, 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 he marched up the field to second because mm-hmm. Charles Leclerc was having issues with his brakes. And then he started to have issues with whatever the problem both all the Mercedes teams had today. Even the uh, 
uh, the the Williams had problems and uh, the McLaren had engine problems today. So I think they're trying something at uh, on the engine. Yeah, I don't think it's working. I think so, the the uh, the Red Bull team and Honda are just clicking on so all George cylinders. So George Russell had said that he was going to get a podium today. That he was shooting for second or third, and he finished fifth, but behind both Ferraris and obviously behind both Red Bulls. Lando Norris had a pretty good race, finishing. No, six. he didn't. I he mean, was, we thought that was going to be the second place car. We thought that was going to be the second best team. And but I'm not. talking about where he qualified. Where did he qualify? At, he qualified like. Fourth or fifth? No, right? he didn't. Let's 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 look on because I I couldn't remember where he qualified. Mm-hmm. So I got it. I brought my trusty uh, notes here. It took me forever to get the password. Yeah, he didn't know what the password. He didn't know the password. Stupid, stupid own Wi-Fi. My what stupid people. I do. Who doesn't business know with. Shut own up. Just, just get on Give it. Give me a break. I, I know like it now. Minutes. I forgot it. It's like fifty words. I don't words. know my password. I don't know how to do it. Uh, don't you have it written down? Somewhere? No, it's on the back of the box. Yeah. That's where the password. All right. At. So Lando Norris qualified seventh, and he finished sixth. So he went up a place. That wasn't a good qualifying. Russell thing. qualified third and he finished fifth. fifth. Verstappen obviously qualified first. Verstappen. Uh, Leclerc qualified second and finished fourth. Science finished qualified fourth and finished second. So that takes care of everybody that we've talked about so far. Lando Norris pretty much had a pretty boring, like, boring nice. race. Like like everybody else, he would have got lapped by by Verstappen if they would have let him fucking turn the engine up. You so. know he he. Ugh. It just wasn't. They didn't even. He was out by himself, kind of. I mean, Hamilton was by him for a lot of the race. Behind him, I think. Dude, everybody's shooting to just. If, if you just, make it on the podium, you won. That's how you should look at. That's it. how you should look at. It. Hamilton qualified ninth, and he finished seventh. So you know that was a decent race for but him. But he said he, he broke his seat. I have yeah. no idea how he. What the. He passed Piastri. He passed uh, on track, and he passed uh, Alonso on track. Alonzo so, was uh, letting people go by him though. Yeah, he, he knew he, he he knew he didn't have the there pace. There was some the race the, pace. The, I don't think he had the. I don't think he can keep the tires under that car for some reason. So now, so how do you break a seat? Have you ever broken a seat? Well, it's made out of. Fo- they're made out of like foam. Okay. So it's it's not a seat like in your car seat. Mm-hmm. It's a thing that they mold to your ass. So it's it's because it. The seat in a race car, you you have to be comfortable in it, and you have to learn how to be comfortable in it because they're not very comfortable. Okay. And his seat, they mold those seats to their ass. So I'm like, I don't know what broken. I'm assuming it cracked. That's the only thing that that it could do because it's made out of foam. Okay. So it's not a, it's not, it's sort of rigid, but not. Um, the only way to, if I, if we, Sh- Sherm is going to show you a picture of a seat. He'll go online and find one. Yeah, I'll do and that. And it's, it's basically just a, it looks like a foam cutout. It mm-hmm. doesn't look like anything either. You is it be, comfortable? Oh yeah. When, once you're, once you're, because you're molded to it, but. A, a race car seat is never comfortable. It's never no. So they had overheating of the engine, and he hit, broke his seat. And he broke his seat. And he was in 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 the Mercedes, and the Mercedes is the third or fourth best car now. I'd probably say they're the third best. I'd say, I, well, I'm, them, it's just be- like we said before. We had said it. We said it was going to be Red Bull. We said it's going to be Ferrari. We, well, we said it's going to be McLaren. We we actually had the Astons ahead of Mercedes, but it looks like Mercedes well, probably is going to be ahead. If of the Mer- if the Mercedes is if, if they broke today, if there was something on the car that because it seemed like all the Mercedes engines had issues today, mm-hmm. all the teams were I spe- and the Williams new steering wheel looks really good by the way. That's a really nice steering wheel. Yeah, well, Logan wasn't nice to Logan Sargent. Logan who just Sargent drove right off. We don't nah something broke on the car. I'm sure because it was like a no. weird, it was a weird place to. Yeah, that turn off, and he he, he, and he just up. and he sat there for a minute, yeah. messing with stuff. So something went wrong with the car. So, so I'm thinking it was the the Mercedes engine. Oscar isn't... Piastri finished in he qualified eighth, and he finished in eighth. Yeah, like I said, though, I don't think the McLarens are very good. They barely even talked about Oscar all today. That's because he was in eighth place. Fernando Alonso finished in ninth. That he, was a very good position. Yeah, qualified sixth. And he had good pace. No, he didn't. His, no, he, I'm saying he had good pace until he wore the tires. Until he off. wore the tires, off. <laughs> and <laughs> I mean, then everybody started and passing then everyone him. Everyone passed him. Like I mean, <laughs> and he just let him by. He was like, "Yeah, had, well, what is he going to do?" No you know, like, I'm not going to. He knew he ran the tires off the car, and he's nothing he could do about it. So that car, I don't think, is good on its tires. The Red Bull obviously is really good on their tires because they went to softs on the last stint 
for like almost 20 laps. Yeah, for almost 20, yeah. That, when they did that, I was like, what on earth are they doing? And of course, they've got the fastest lap probably, right? Of course. Yeah. It's Max. It's Max. All right. And then Lance Stroll, who finished in 10th place, who I think really? had a really good comeback because he, did he hit, Hulkenberg, or did Hulkenberg hit him? It was strange. Like he slowed down, and Hulkenberg. He's not a very good driver. You know, That's why that was not Hulkenberg's turn, fault. I guarantee you, it turn wasn't one, Hulk, and then it wasn't Hulkenberg's fault. No, for sure. And then, then he pitted early. He was twenty four seconds like behind the whole field, other than obviously Logan Sargent. Well, we never had a and we never had a safety car or a virtual safety car. And then somehow he found the pace to get all the way back up to tenth, which I get to talk about, and that is one hundred percent on Cash App. Wait, Carb, Visa Cash App uh, Car RB. RB. It's 100%. Toro Rosso is what fault. we're going to call it. 100% their fault. There is no way in God's green earth that Yuki Tsunoda should have not finished 10th. He was 10th the whole time. He had great pace for 10th. And but then. He couldn't, he couldn't pass fucking. No, uh, but, but, he couldn't but, pass but, Magnuson. No, but what happened is he got See, what undercut. had happened was. No, he got. They let him under get undercut I know. by Zhao, Magnuson, Stroll, all undercut him. Now, if you're in. It was. So, my dog of the day, and I'm going to give a big boo. Where's my boo? Where's my boo? Where's my boo? Boo, boo, boo. There it is. Boo. I'm going to give a big boo, boo. to Cash App, Visa RB. Their race strategies, Toro Rosso, that's what and their call team it. strategies. Because one, there's no way Yuki should have been undercut by a thousand people. He's in tenth. Soon as, because Hamilton was in ninth at that time. Soon as Hamilton pits, then you should pit. Cover, cover, cover. They left him out. It's Saturday, right? Yes. Why does it feel like Sunday? Uh, because the races are no. I worked. On I Sunday. worked too many days in the uh, last couple. So of anyhow, they. Let all these teams undercut him. They left him out on those crappy old tires. He came in, and then he came back in traffic. And somehow, some way, he's competing for 13th place with five laps left on and in the race. And then they told him to move they over. They asked that him to switch with Daniel Ricciardo so they could get 13th place. Is there, is there points for 12th place, Mike? No. Is there points for 13th place, no. Mike? Why are you asking Yuki Sonoda, who ha- who you screwed up his strategy, to have... He still would have finished where they're at. The yeah, red. That, they both that, finished where they're at. That car is not very good. He would have finished 10th if it wasn't for the strategy, and Yuki was pissed. And I'm going to put it up right here. He almost ran Daniel Ricciardo Yuki off the road. is Sherman's favorite driver. No, I have no idea he's why. My, He's my second He's or third like, favorite. He's uh, like not a very good driver. He uh, is a good he driver. He will never be in the Red Bull. He had horrible um, strategy. This is today. his last year in Formula One. He shouldn't have had this year. You're in you're insane. They should have put Again, Liam you're in. You're insane. The, Stop it with your insanity. Liam is a uh, way better driver. Liam is know. better than Ricardo. Ricardo's not that good anymore. Well, yeah, he He's is. He's shot. No. <sighs> Get off. And Daniel by the way, nuts. this is my prediction for 2025. No, no. Sebastian Vettel going to Mercedes. No. You heard it here first. No, it's not gonna happen. It's not gonna happen. <laughs> you heard it here so, first. Don't listen to him. He's. He, I'm always right, Mike. That's you what owe you me should... three dollars, actually. No, I don't. You do. You well, lost three bets. I'm letting them. Let four. I'm you letting them. Give me my I'm, money. I'm letting uh, it ride. My, I see four dollars right there. We gotta I'm let it ride. It. Though. I'm taking it. I'm taking it. Take the four dollars. I want up my there. four dollars. Is like. I'm gonna take one of your trophies if you don't give me that four dollars. That's a hundred and fifty baht. Give me. <laughs> it's a back massage. No, bot, bot. I said it's a back massage. No, it's a, it's a bot massage. Trust me. You can, so, get, you can get nice bot uh, massages so they, there for so thirty dollars. Um, I'm gonna put it up here that he had a little harsh words to say for the team, and I don't blame him. He's not gonna be on that team next year. It doesn't matter. The next race is in Saudi they are not, they Arabia. Are not, the only reason he's in that car is because he's Japanese. That's it. They they don't have a good Japanese driver to put in the oh, Honda, so man, they got that on. dude. Don't, don't don't talk about Yuki All like right, that. All right, next victim. Who's next on the hit parade? So next race is Saudi Arabia. No, but who's the next person I get to talk That's shit it. about? We talked we talked about the top ten. What about the top the other the other oh, idiots? What about them? Well, come on, let's what? talk about them. Name one guy <clears throat> who finished out of the top ten that you want to talk about other than Botas. Okay, go ahead. 
Botas should be in a good car. I don't know why he's in that car. I don't know why no one's giving him. A, he should get if if they uh, if they don't put Vettel in the Mercedes, they should put Botas back in the Mercedes because he. I was, agree. He one hundred percent. I agree. Botas. Well, I think Science will probably get that seat. Uh, Science is probably going to go to the Audi team. Or, no, I don't think so because this is his prime years. You can remember see, his dad was listen, on the Audi I don't, team. It doesn't matter because it's going to take Audi at least three seasons to mm. get up to speed. Yeah, and they're already talking about like. Right? It looks like there's a very good possibility that will be the Andretti team. So, because so, Audi, because all the guys who who did the Formula One thing for Audi don't work for Audi anymore. So there's not going to be an Audi Formula One no. team. I highly doubt it. I highly doubt it too. Andretti's going to be in Formula One somehow. They, somewhere, I have no sure. idea why they're not in Formula. Sure. It makes no sense. They were bringing a manufacturer. They were going to be a works team. Yes. And. The worst works team in Formula One right now is the Alpine team. Why they're so oh, bad. Oh, okay. That's something we can I, talk I, about. I have no idea that why they're so bad. That is something we can talk about. That they're is horrible. A, that championship team. Oh, they're wow. a championship they caliber so team. I think they have the budget. Now they just need some leadership to go over there. I wish Ross Braun would go back over they there. They look that. so If Ross Braun went you're back. You're going to bring Ross Braun out of If Ross Braun and Simmons, him out of, and Simmons I mean, why went over there, even though they bring both. Him out of they, they retirement. Both, Leave that they man both, alone. They let both him, retired. Let him be retired. I know. If him and Simmons went over there, oh my God, they would. That, it would be instant like you that. You know what? Here's a crazy controversial prediction Con what, everything we do is controversial what are you, you and about? i could do a better job than the alpine seems doing right now. i wouldn't go that far i'm like they I, just they just don't have a good car right now i feel bad for gasly i they, don't really they, feel bad well, for i don't Ocon i don't I'm feel bad for either of them. i don't they're both hoopty formula one drivers don't it's, say it's, that. it's it's don't say it they they need good drivers over don't, there they don't need say good that. management I don't say it. they need stability they don't say it firing they keep better coming up with Donald Trump to mess with you find Donald Trump to mess with you Donald Trump okay right now. this team is like they bought their team back in the team they bought six team they bought this team back China whatever that company that owned the Lotus team yeah and they've done nothing but run this team into the ground they First, they didn't have a principal for a while for yes. some reason. They had no leadership. They had they were leading by uh, uh, like a bunch of guys were all the bosses, and I was like, that never works. You have to have a boss. Christian right. Horner has been running uh, the Red Bull team, and uh, Helmut Marco is the, I guess the CEO. I'm like, I'm not sure how their structure is, but someone's got to be the boss. Period. The end. Get someone to be the boss. The end. Because they fired, uh, they fire a lot of people. There's a lot of movement in the Alpine. What's his team name was there? Year. He wasn't even there for a year, and he was like has a history of working for the mm -hmm. uh, the um, what the hell? Uh, it's the Aston, yeah, it's the Aston Martin team now. It used to be the Racing Point team. It was something else before that. It was it was the Jordan team? The Aston Martin team is now the Jordan team. So he has a reputation at doing very a lot with very little mm -hmm. and they sent him over there and they just got rid of him and it's like wh why would you hire someone and then fire them nine months later it makes no there's no leadership there's no in, leadership at Renault right there's now. no stability uh i think the head guy for alpine's like a clothing guy oh, you know he's not a racing car we need we need a, he's, a, he's a flavio briatore would be a good choice he's there's, sitting at the house doing nothing right now that's a good choice mike Hell yeah. That's a good choice. I thought he should have went to Ferrari, but he, he's that sitting at the house. That is a good choice. Because he's already taken that team twice. Yes. He had him with the Benetton, and then he had him when he went back and had Alonso with the two championships. They need Flavio, they need Ross Braun, and Simmons. Those three guys, I know they're 150,000 years old, but they need to go in there and build it. They, they know how to build a team. Well, the one thing I think <clears> about <throat> Alpine is when I, think, when, when I hear the name Alpine, I think instability. I think of people well, coming should, in and they going, should call think it the, of leaving, go, coming, going, going somewhere else. They That's should rebrand it back to the Renault team and call it that because the Alpine is a, is a small brand in the Renaults. I don't know why they're trying Maybe to... Maybe Renault it. doesn't want to be involved with it. Well, Maybe they don't everyone want Everyone knows name. it's the Renault team. They just rebranded it, the Alpine team, a couple years ago, which I like the well, first year well, They car. got a car. They got like a supercar. They got a hypercar. You know, they got to pump that up. You know, and if you go they back need, to Renault, they need someone to run their. The they need someone to run their Formula One team because right now it's in. They and they fired Alan Permain, who had been there for thirty years. I mean, years. did they finish behind the Haas today? Let me. I think they yes. did. Yes, they're the last place car. I think they, uh, let's see. I Were think they, the they last finished place? behind. I think they, they started and they went up the grid. Where did they finish? So. They finished seventeenth and eighteenth. Jesus Christ! They're a, they're a works team. So they should Hulkenberg, be Hulkenberg, Albon, Sonoda, Ricardo, Magnussen, Zhao, all the head of 
usually what is a scoring points team. Usually they're like around the seventh and eighth. No, team. they did the same thing last year. They finished dead last last year in the first race. They did they? Yeah. Well, but it looks like they're way off the pace, though. But At least last year, no, they they're had some... way. Their car sucks. Their car is like way off the pace. It's not fast. It's heavy. They've already said their car is overweight. So Max you know. <laughs> won by twenty-two seconds over Perez. Let's see how far was the Mercedes. The closest Mercedes was forty-six seconds. Russell was forty-six seconds behind. I'm telling you, the Mercedes is done. So he literally all, he had over a minute to. Um, well, look at all ninth the people. So look at all the Aston pe- Martin. Wow. All the people that have left the uh, wow. Mercedes team to go someplace else. It's like Ferrari, half, half the team. Red Bull, you know, Williams, Williams Vals, 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 Vals. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. they all got promotions to go someplace else, and of course they make more money, so they're going to leave. And now that team is they like when they when James Allison quit two years ago, and they they promoted the other guy to to run the uh, to be the technical director, mm-hmm. and he built two shit cars, and then. Red Bull took his ideas and, and won the race today. I can't believe they did that. I can't, they did that just to mess with Mercedes. I'll tell you, I know that. If we didn't have a Formula One show, I would have turned that sh- that race off after ten laps. I would have never watched the race after. It was so boring. There was no race. It was it was like all it was like it was like all the races last year and all the races next year are going to be exactly the same. Formula One. Has to go in there and put a parachute on the fucking Red they Bull. They have to. They have to. That's or the only way. Or take their DRS away or something or give them, or give them say one set of tires. Say their floor or something. <laughs> they have to. No. No. They have to go in But they say, can't do anything, though. They're, they're in the regulations. They already went through certain No. They got to they gotta, they they gotta really go through it with a fine tooth comb. <laughs> they can't comb. do shit. They can't do shit. No, no they can't. Know why they can because if they can do AD 2021, they can do anything they want. Okay. If this was NASCAR, this shit would never be going on. They would they would have went in there and did something to that to the. Uh, they got to do something. They have to. They have to go well, that's in. That's the whole point. And they have to say this is illegal. Take it off. The problem. They okay. The the main problem with Formula One is it's a constructor series. Everyone builds their own cars, and if you screw your car up, you're fucked for the entire season. There's no way to fix it. There, when you start off the 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 um the testing and your car's a dog, it's going to be a dog at the end of the season. The crap McLaren did last year. Everyone said, "Oh, they came with new." No, no, no. They got new tires. That's what made that car better. That's what made the car better. And uh, when your car's a dog at the beginning of the season, like the Alpine is right now, it's never going to get that much better. They're going to make improvements to it, I'm right. sure, but it it won't be enough because they're already so far behind. They're, they're two 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 and a half seconds off the pace. If there maybe more, you we don't know because we don't know what the Red Bulls are doing. Do they ever turn their engine up today? I doubt it. Well, the first couple laps, and then no, after I don't that. even think they did that. I think the whole time the car was he was so far ahead already, and then Perez looked like he was just chugging along. He he, you know, he just chugged past everyone and just he's in second place, and they they win in their first and second. And that's what it's going to be like all year. If Formula One, unless Ferrari comes up with, I doesn't think, do something to the Red Bull car, they're not going to do anything. What gonna are going to be do? another season like last year? It's going to be just like they're going to lose year. a lot of fans. They, a lot of people going to stop watching. Well, of course, all the people who watch stupid fucking Drive to Survive, they're not Formula One fans. Every time these idiots show up to my house to watch a race, I have to sit there for the entire race explaining to them. This is how this is. When, like, when does the race start? The race is on right now. <laughs> <laughs> when does the race start? When are they going to start racing? Well, they are racing. They are racing. It looks like a procession. Yeah. Yeah. Well, what do, what's your prediction for next week, Saudi Arabia? Um, I think Michael Andretti is going to win the race. <laughs> is Max going to win by 22 seconds again? I have no idea. It's a, it's a street circuit. The, maybe the Red Bull won't be that good next week. Who well, knows? maybe Sergio will win because he's a street he's a street. Oh, that's right. Guy. He's, a, he's that's a street guy. guy. You know? did, did he, he won Monaco last year, too. <laughs> he won two races <laughs> last year. You all right? Oh. Bless me. You all right? Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to live. You, you okay? I'm going to live. Ooh, I ooh. need an antacid. So that's it and a, for and a histamine. the review and a histamine? of the Bahrain Grand Prix. Bahrain. Bahrain, 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 the Bahrain Grand Prix. Grand Prix. We want you to join us next week for hopefully a Don't better Don't join race. us next week. It's not going to be the same. Well, you got to join us next week. Well, I mean, they're going to they're gonna, they're, they like us. They'll watch us. Buy a cup of coffee. I think, I think watching our show is better than actually watching the race. 
I'm or like, listening yeah, at to least us. we're doing Watching something. Or listening. Something's happening, you know. At least it's just not one guy just way ahead of everybody else. It's like the it's like I can't believe we're gonna have three of these seasons in a row, and there's nothing, nobody. I, I'm telling you, Formula One needs to up do the 2026 regulations next year. That's the only thing that's gonna fix this. And Tune then in next gonna, week and for then another else show is figure out of the, America, the better mousetrap, and we're gonna be right in this same America place. F1. Keep on racing, everybody. Keep on trucking. Are we done? You should put a money sign right there.